Mention it all. Mention it all. Goodbye, Kyle. Who's calling who a frog? Love you, baby. Bye. Hello, Beverly Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. Girl, we need to talk about the Real Housewife of New Jersey because Teresa was doing press yesterday and she was spreading love, love, love and tea, tea, tea left and right, okay? And we need to talk about it. Uh, but before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it right now. If you are new here and you want to join the Beverly Troop, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, guys. We are on our way to 30K. So if you want to join the family, you know what to do. And let's talk about this mess. Okay, so, I mean, the season is over. We are moving into reunion next week. Uh, that's going to be interesting because that reunion, the fact that Andy Cohen is having, like, a full meltdown, I am dying. It means that that reunion is going to be fire. Okay, and I'm I, I cannot wait. Honestly, I'm very excited. I love you know that I live for the drama, so uh, I'm very excited about that. So Teresa was doing press. Uh, what is coming next? What is happening? Or does she stand with everything? Um, actually, before we go into what Teresa said, I just I found something that I, I wanted to share with you guys, and it's uh, Dina Manso uh, share something on her Instagram. Which I was like, oh my God, this is like sweet, but so shady at the same time. You know that Dina is actually one of Teresa's like best, best friends. Like they love each other. She's going to be part of the wedding. I don't know if she's the maid of honor or one of the bridemaids or something like that. But it's like she is the one, you know. Um, she put their children bond, uh, talking about Louis, of course. Their children bond so effortlessly. I see Louis' family open their arms and give Teresa the sisters she's always craved and fill some of the parental void of her broken heart. Girl, the shade against Melissa is like, no, Melissa, you are never going to be a Teresa sister, okay? Like, Teresa can't stand you, which is going to be shown, like, now on what we're going to be talking, which is Teresa doing press. Girl, like... Um, uh, someone asked her about, you know, Melissa not being part of the wedding and she defend her position. She said, no, Melissa is not going to be part of the wedding. They are invited, of course, but she's not going to be part of the wedding party, you know? And she says basically like Melissa is a coworker. Melissa is my sister-in-law and that's it. Okay. I don't have to invite her. I don't have to uh, involve her, okay? And I have been saying this from the beginning. I'm sorry, but Melissa has never been on Teresa's team, you know? So, if like, even if you like or not like Teresa, whatever, I'm thinking, like, if you are getting married, you will like to have people who support you and your partner, you know, getting married. But Melissa has never been there for them. Melissa has never been really, like, uh, um, supporting Teresa. And I feel that, Ther that Melissa did something very shady this season. And it was, like, every single time that they were fighting, you know, Melissa made sure to say in front of the camera, oh, we have to go with Teresa because otherwise it's going to be hell. Oh, oh, I mean, if I don't go with her, if I don't say this, if I don't do that, then Teresa is going to come for me. Teresa is going to do something to me. Teresa is going to be basically kind of like saying like, oh, Teresa is a bad one. Teresa is the one who doesn't let me do anything. Teresa is the one who doesn't want me to do anything, you know, kind of putting it out there. So how after doing that? And she's not stupid. Melissa knows that this is going to be on camera. Okay. So, I still don't understand why Melissa was so surprised that Teresa didn't involve her on, <laughs> on the wedding, you know? It is true. They are not close. 
And uh, actually, Melissa, I think she's in LA right now. And uh, a paparazzi like caught her, caught her, you know. And uh, they she uh, they asked her all these questions, you know. And she was very like close into everything. Was like you have to watch the reunion. You have to watch the reunion. You have to watch the reunion. But at one point, she actually said they asked her about her relationship with uh, Teresa and if they were okay. And the only thing, and she said, uh, "We're sisters in law. We're family. We're always going to be okay." You know, it was like the tone, like they don't support each other. They don't care about each other. And I don't think they have to care each other. As long as they don't intervene with the relationship between Teresa and Joe, which are brother and sister, you know, I think that's fine. You know, I mean, of course, in a perfect world, and I do believe that all family members should like, you know, get along. If they don't, they don't, you know, like whatever. Um, so yeah, Teresa did say that, you know, and for the other piece of the tea, uh, they asked Teresa if, you know, she was ready to, if she was coming back next season or if she was ready to go, you know, she's living on her, uh, love bubble, you know, that she said, she said that she will protect her love bubble no matter what. And she said that if she has to stop talking to people or distance herself from certain people, she will do it just to protect her love bubble. Yeah. So, you know how I feel. Because you know that I like Teresa, but you know that I have my reservations with Louis, okay? So, I'm I'm still, like, caution. You know, I'm like, mm, I don't know, Teresa, like... I want I want Teresa to be happy and to live in her bubble, but like open your eyes inside the bubble, you know, and not be like dumb. Uh, but yeah, we'll see about that. And um, okay, so yeah, so they asked her if she will come back, you know, because there were some rumors saying that maybe Louis is not ready for this life, maybe he doesn't want to be on the reality t a a show anymore. And that will mean that we will, like, lose Teresa or something. But Teresa actually said that she is not going anywhere, okay? That she is coming back next season and that she started the show and that she will leave the show when, basically, when the show is over, I guess. I mean, basically, she said she is the queen of New Jersey and that... It will go as long as she wanted to go. Girl. It's just like the power for me right there. Um, so, yeah. That's basically all the tea that it was spilled right now. So, let's move into the reunion. Let's see what is going to happen. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. About this whole Teresa, Melissa, Dina, Louis, future, whatever situation. Let me know in the comments below. And like always, don't forget to like this video. Share this video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.